just for fun. And they would DK Ditto all the time and go, ha, 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 and then false beat MK Leo too with DK. <laughs> so them having fun uh, playing these big characters made a difference. So sometimes, guys, you have to think outside the box. Yes. Don't look for playing Kirby just because you like Kirby. Look for that character that might be able to add to your gameplay. You know what else is fun? Winning. Oh, yeah, that's true. Keep I like that in mind, guys. Keep that in mind. So here we go. Hammer right here uh, from Canada right there. You see him representing Canada right across the pond, actually. You notice that river where that Caesar's Palace is? That's actually Canada. Oh, yeah. I just remember that before I passed by it. And I think Karanol definitely has a good handle on what he wants to do in this matchup, especially because he keeps jabbing a lot. I didn't even realize he knows what he's doing. You man. can just keep Bowser out with jab really well. I told you, man, like he, if he's able to just kind of set up, get that wall intact and make it so difficult for Bowser to really just penetrate, it's it's gonna be a it's gonna be a hard time for Hammer man. He's looking to drop one right now, but they're reaching to that toolbox man because you might need a couple. Wow, that was really nice actually going for that throw attack instead of um actually forward throwing. I feel like most people would just throw forward throw Bowser off the stage and try to edge guard. Okay. But Karanol is like, no, I can actually KO you. Almost got the KO. I feel that he was pretty close right there. Only at 12 percent right here. Ooh. Now Hammer is looking to strike, trying to create an opening right here. Luma is, uh, well she's back right now, but she's absent for the moment there. Ooh. That was very nice. It is very laggy to do a short hop back air, but he was really confident to get the back air to hit, and he did not die. Oh, mm. my God. I told you this guy's going to be explosive. You already know, man. I mean, he was trailing quite a bit right here, so for him to bring oh! it back. Sorry. Uh, I knew it. Even by this amount is pretty good right now. <laughs> I knew it. Tell your prophecy is coming to life right here. I knew this guy would be crazy. Most people would go, let me just get a simple edge guard. Let me try to get the grab. This guy went for a down P. What's he going to go for next? But that's kind of explosive and nutty plays that can really get you back from a situation like this, man. So I don't blame him for kind of throwing out things a little unconventional right there, but going to end up uh, taking the L right there on that first stock. Yeah. But considering that he started out like in the 140s and he was only at uh, 12 percent, this is a pretty good spot to be in. And there it is. I didn't even get to finish my point right there. All it took was one grab. Town and City not doing Cano uh, any favors. All right, it's, it's launched off the top. And again, I did feel like this would be a tough matchup a little bit for Rosalina um, because Bowser's just so strong and Rosalina's so light. Oh, okay, I just keep pressing the A button over and over. You'll be able to approach <laughs> Rosalina. For some reason, he went for that grab right there. Oh my gosh. This is definitely looking like it's in Hammer's uh, advantage at the moment, even though he's losing a percent. Feels like he learned how to approach Rosalina and take out Luma. I mean, he was getting absolutely bopped on that first stock, man, but. Just figuring out a way right here, really kind of evened out the neutral game here. Wow, I'm surprised both of those grabs missed. He should be able to recover. Yep, he's going to go for something explosive because he is hammer. I'm actually surprised Cornell uh, isn't, like, anticipating these downers. Yeah. Yeah, because he's going for it every single time. Hammer's always going for Yeah, he hasn't really switched up the game plan as far as when he's trying to uh, touch the stage right there from above, so... All right, but this is the point where it makes it hard for Bowser trying to recover yeah. against a fully jabbing Rosalina. He's just dancing on him right here. Wow, and it actually clashed. But that grab right there oh, could be a that. KO. Don't get grabbed on that platform, brother. And he spot dodged there, too. He did not go on the aggressive side. He should have <laughs> just ran away. He should have dropped through. He should have never landed on the platform, actually. Hey, Tarl, the wise words of wisdom right here. And Karanol able to... S able. That was and how he finished eye. right there. I like that. That was questionable with the eye because he was not expecting that neutral. He was probably expecting just a full jab. So it was one, two. He thought, okay, he's gonna hit me up. I'll di away. Right. Di away from a neutral air was KO. Those are good mix-ups right there in those in those tight situations. You know, you kind of make that call and find some success. So, all right. So let's see what Hammer is gonna do. I feel like that was a good stage for him. He could get KOs off the top easier because it's a lower ceiling. And but so he's probably gonna go back to the same stage. Yep, right. just as expected. See what he could switch up. I felt like he started to adapt towards the end, but then he got knocked to the ledge, and that's where everything went terrible. So he needs to just stay away from that ledge, and it looks like Karen Noel is already trying to push him off. No forward Ooh. throws coming out yet, though. Okay. One, two. One, two. One, two. <laughs> All right. <laughs> One, May two step, man. Yeah, Mayweather versus McGregor. We got Mayweather, you know, jabbing. Yes, uh, he, did, he did do some jabs in that yeah, fight. Yeah, he did do some jabs, right? Thank you, E, for the follow-up. <laughs> Kato is ridiculous right here, man. All right, and now, actually, Hammer is putting a lot of pressure on Karanol, but Karanol is just doing a simple forward there to get back on, but these jabs should be able to knock Luma off almost. Mm. Oh, oh, goodness. Wow. Yeah, tried to slide in there with that forward smash. I'm telling you, man, Hammer just looks like that type of guy oh, that would go for the F-smash. He looks like that kind of guy who just fell prey to one of those Rosalina death traps. Up in the sky like that, you already know stocks can disappear even at the lower half of those percents. So that is an uh, unfortunate situation Hammer found himself in, but I mean, we saw what he did in that last game, man. Able to just kind of bring it back despite trailing quite a bit. 
Yeah, maybe even one that. grab, like right here, yeah. might be able to get the stop. Oh my gosh, or a back air simply. But he's going for a lot of risky moves that are easy to punish. If he gets it to work, it's a death. But if you block it four times in a row, you're taking 40%. Here it is. Ooh. All right, big time belly flop right there. Got him off stage. And not committing to anything. Just kind of sitting in his shield right there. Maybe trying to catch him jumping off right there. I saw him throwing out a couple of back airs. Not coming up with anything, though. All right. The crowd was cheering Hammer a lot before, but not so much anymore. They actually decided not to land for an aerial this time, trying to mix it up. But it doesn't matter for Rosalina. Rosalina has two people on the ground ready to attack as soon as you land. So it's hard to do a Tomahawk. Downer? Nope. Oh, yeah. It's hard to land right here. Just trying to find a way. Wow. He landed with a down air um, and still got punished for it. And this is a really tough spot for him. He can just get F smash and it's over. And he can't even recover. Oh and that little, uh, that little dance hit star right there. It's over. Really just, oh my goodness. Is he not trying to so jump through air dodge? Okay, there we go. Yeah, I was like, at some point, like, there are, you do have some other options to come off that ledge right there, but yeah, I guess he was over. just being a little stubborn right here. Let's see if he'll, uh, he's just kind of hanging right there. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's a tough spot to be in. Jump air dodge. And you hear the crowd, hey. Jump air dodge. Hey. <laughs> hey. Oh, no. Come on. <laughs> just, Jump uh, fair, jump fair. This is just rude right now. Jump up air, jump up air. Drop down up air. Okay, you know what? It's over. That was, that was a rough one. <laughs> that was a rough one. That's like, <laughs> he's, he's playing the symphony all over his face right there. So. I know, well, you know, uh, sometimes a matchup can be a little tough depending on the situation you're in. So good stuff to Karanol for just sitting there and holding the A button. I told you, man, somebody who shows up with a plushie in their lap of their character, pretty much hedge your bet on them. Yeah.